Hi, you're listening to Small Things Often from the Gottman Institute, where we talk you through research-based tips to help improve your relationships in five minutes or less. Today's tip is about self-disclosure. It's really important to open up to your partner and reveal your most authentic self. But there are some things that are just really difficult to talk about, aren't there? Deep things, private things, things you may have kept held tightly inside your whole life about what you think, how you feel, or maybe even who you are. Maybe it involves something from your childhood that you have never told anyone, but is now impacting your life as an adult in your relationship with your partner. Or perhaps it's something you passionately like or dislike that you've never thought to share with them. But if you do, that might help your partner have a better understanding about your reactions to certain situations. The point is that self-disclosure, really opening up about yourself to the person you love, creates intimacy. In fact, self-disclosure of emotions rather than just facts or information is a pretty important predictor of the best kind of intimacy in relationships. Because the more you know about how your partner feels emotionally, the more connected you may feel, and the more capable you are of being there for them, no matter what the circumstances. So open up. Encourage your partner to do the same. Reveal your hopes, your fears, your dreams, your feelings. Show them the wonderful, unique, weird, complicated person you are. And watch trust flourish and your relationship deepen. Sure, you may be a little nervous, but you won't be sorry. Today's small thing. Carve out some quiet time to talk to your partner and intentionally self-disclose. Ask questions that encourage you both to open up and reveal feelings and thoughts you've never talked about. Tune in to the next episode of Small Things Often for another quick tip from the Gottman Institute, helping you maintain and strengthen all of your relationships.